Sumo Day 2024 is finally here and I compiled all of the Sumo Day deals that launched for the promotion in this free checklist. There are a total of about 23 tools that launched specifically for the promotion. Now, if you want free access to this spreadsheet, click the link in my description and you'll go to this landing page right here where you'll put your first name and email address to gain instant access to that free spreadsheet. Now you also have the opportunity to enroll in my first ever giveaway where I'll be choosing one lucky winner to win all of this really cool AppSumo swag. Okay, so the first deal I wanna show you is Active Pieces. Now this is an alternative to Zapier. It starts at $59 and of course you do get an additional 10% off for the Sumo Day promotion. Now, what I like about the tool is that it is relatively easy to use, okay? So this is the back end, and you first need to set up your trigger. Now, I really like how you can choose a webhook as a trigger with tier one, all right? Now, there are some other tools, other lifetime deals that don't offer the webhook as a trigger, but this one does, okay? So to set up the webhook, uh, just copy and paste the URL, into the app that you want to send the information to via the webhook, all right? Now, there are other um, triggers as well. So these are all of the apps that you can set up as triggers. And there's also the core apps from Active Pieces. So the forms in beta, schedule, SFTP, and of course, the webhook, okay? And then you can set up your apps. So after the webhook gets triggered, um, I set up my MailerLite account. Now you need to select an action, right? So add a subscriber to a group, update a subscriber or so forth. And you can select which groups in your MailerLite account to send to after the webhook trigger gets activated. Now, I also really like some of the filtering type of options as well. So if the webhook or any app gets triggered, you can set up an approval process. Uh, you can set up a delay. Now, I really like the branch here. So you can set up a branch if whatever trigger is true, you can send it to one app. If it's false, you can choose nothing or send it to a different app, okay? So if this webhook is true, you can select an app, like say, for example, send it to Active Campaign. If it's false, you can send it to another app as well. Now, one of the biggest things you, of course, need to check are the integrations, okay? So this is all of the integrations and feel free to check their website to see if the tools that you use are listed here. Now they do have a very active community as well. Um, I participated in the community a few months ago about the MailerLite integration to add more uh, features to it. And their developers actually uh, listen and updated the MailerLite integration. So you can check out any announcements they have. Um, if there is no tool, you can add a feature request to see if they can add it, okay? And again, there are tons of active requests here and the developers do communicate with you, which is really nice. Now, if you compare this with Zapier in terms of pricing, so Zapier starts at $19.99 per month for 750 tasks, but for the Active Pieces lifetime deal, uh, for $59, it will allow you to get access to 10,000 tasks, tasks per month. All right, so the limits are uh, pretty generous, I would say, but if you want more tasks, you can upgrade to tier two or higher. Now, one thing to note is the minute sync time. So if you do tier three, it will unlock one minute sync time for scheduled triggers. So if you want things to sync quickly, then you could get tier three. Now the next must buy deal is Afri. Now this one is similar to ChatGPT, but for this specific tool, it actually reads any documents and files you upload to it. So very, very unique. So this is the back end, and basically what you need to do is upload files, okay? So you can go to your library here, and you basically upload various files like PDFs, Microsoft documents, text documents, PowerPoint, and so forth. And you will have all of your files in your library and you could use their chat to analyze the files and provide you with information with the files you provided it. So if you do a lot of um, academic research or if you are a marketer analyzing 
data, this is a very handy tool. So I uploaded um, a Excel file earlier and I asked it, what are the low competition keywords? Now, just for reference, this is the file that I provided it. So tons of keywords here with competition and all of this metrics. So I wanted Afri to help me analyze it. So I asked, what are the low competition keywords? And it says, based on the data provided, here are the low competition keywords I was able to identify. So it identified five low competition keywords. And I also asked it to put it in a chart for easy viewing. So it did that right here. So if you have tons of data to analyze, you could use this chat feature to help you analyze that data. Now let's see what else it can do. So I'm gonna click on prompts and you can click on summarize a document, click on send. Okay, so here is the summary of the document. So keyword competition levels, the data includes a competition index, and then there's also low competition keywords, high competition, which it listed out, and also the various keyword metrics in the document. Now, if you're interested in Afri, it starts at $49 and you'll have 20 gigabytes of document storage and 1,000 one-time API credits. And you can also bring your own key as well for ChatGPT4, Claude, Sonnet, Gemini, etc. Now with tier two, it'll increase your limits and it will also give you advanced AI model rate limit of 20 calls every three hours. And if you do tier three, the rate limits will increase. So I think tier one or tier two would be uh, the sweet spot here. Now the next tool is Merlin. So this one starts at $69. Now this tool is similar to ChatGPT, but it has 20 plus AI tools and models for research and writing. So this is a Chrome extension that you can use across any website. So this is the back end. So you can chat with Merlin similarly to ChatGPT, but it integrates other large language models. You can also chat with your documents. So you can upload PDFs, PowerPoint slides, text documents, and have Merlin pull data to help you answer your questions. Now it's similar to Afri, where you can use their chat to analyze documents. But with Afri, it's basically more on steroids where you can upload hundreds of files, you can sort them, and you could use their chat to really do some serious research across a variety of files. But with Merlin, it's a little bit more watered down. Now you also have chat bots as well. You could create your own bots. So add information to it and you can chat with your own chat bot and you also can generate images. They also have a code interpreter. Now, in terms of the large language models, these are all of the ones that are available right now, including GPT-40 and also Claude 3, including Opus and Gemini Pro and Flash. Now, Merlin also allows you to access the web as well. So it's similar to a Google search whenever you are chatting. Now, again, you could use this tool like this or you could use it on any website. Okay, so if you say, for example, highlight this and you can call up Merlin and on the left right hand side, you can start chatting with it. So you can select web access, choose your large language model here and start chatting with it. So we, I can say something like, please summarize this. And here we go, this is a summary. And since we did select web access, it did include a few links as well. You can also save prompts, you can attach files and images as well. So very powerful. You can also open the chat in tab and you saw that earlier, right? So this is the chat, but in tab format. Now this is very similar to Voila. Um, I use Voila daily. It's an amazing tool. Now, if you want me to do a comparison between uh, Merlin and Voila, uh, let me know in the comments and I'll do a very deep dive comparison. Now, if you are interested in Merlin starting at $69 uh, with tier one, you do get 5,000 credits per month. But with tier two, it increases your credits and it unlocks the ability to bring your own open AI API key. So I'm not sure exactly why they force you to upgrade to tier two to bring your own API key, but that's how this deal is set up. So if you are paying for OpenAI, you may wanna get tier two, but if you are not, I'm not paying for OpenAI, so I would just do tier one. And I have other AI tools that I use, so I think 5,000 credits per month is fine personally for me.
Now the next tool is Mini Course Generator. Now if you want to see my full in-depth review and demo of Mini Course Generator, uh, click the link in my description. Now this one starts at $89. And what I like about this is that you can create courses very, very quickly. Like if you are a digital entrepreneur and you've always wanted to make your own course, make money online through courses, this is a tool that will help you with that, okay? Now this creates courses, but you could also create quizzes and other things, interactive things like that, that you, that you can embed on your website. Okay, now you can create courses and combine them into various collections. So right here, I have three courses in my collection called Affiliate Marketing Bootcamp. So here is how the course looks like. Now this course was generated with their AI. Okay, so I just gave it a few prompts and it generated this entire course on affiliate marketing. So you can see the outline on the left hand side. Okay, and if you click on any of the subheadings, it'll go to this specific lesson. Now these images are AI generated. All of this text is AI generated as well. And of course you can upload your own videos and most likely you will be recording videos and uploading them for each individual card. Now you can also create a new card, like add information knowledge, you can add gateways, you can add multiple choice. Now this one is nice. You can actually create a quiz and embed that quiz on your website to engage with your audience, collect leads and things like that. So I really like the ability to use mini course generator in various creative ways. And you can also use it as feedback as well. Like if you are a brick and mortar business or a service based business, you can create a card asking for feedback. So it's not just courses that you can create with this tool, but you could create feedback forms, quizzes, and things like that. You can also connect your custom domain here. And there's also automations that you can set up through Zapier and Make. Now, in terms of creating a course, um, you can create um, manually by starting from scratch or use their AI course generator. So if you wanna create from scratch, click here, add your cover image and your title and click on create. And here is where you manually create individual lessons in your course. And you can also use their AI quiz generator to create a quiz from the courses that you create as well. Now, if you're interested in this, um, it starts at $89 for the first code and it gives you 30 mini courses, 75 AI credits per month and five gigabytes of storage for video uploads. Now the 75 AI credits per month is so that you can use their AI generator to generate an entire course from scratch. So if you wanna create a course from scratch, it will deduct credits. And if you want to create AI images, it'll deduct credits as well, right? And if you go to plan two, it'll increase your limit, limits and you can export your course to PDF. You can enable access after someone pays and also automations with Zapier and Make. And then with plan three, you get additional features as well. So in terms of the payments, so if you go back to my collections and click on learners access. So if you do a uh, plan two for payments, you will unlock enable access behind a paywall. Okay, so if you wanna earn money through your courses, uh, you'll need tier two, where you can connect your Stripe, Lemon Squeezy, or Pabli account. Now you can also enable access to specific learners as well here by inviting learners by a magic link or enable access with in-app authentication. Okay, now for the in-app authentication, you will need plan three for that. And the last must buy deal is Spirit Me. So this is an AI avatar generator. Now very, very trendy right now. So you could use this to create your no face YouTube channels, uh, TikTok, re TikTok videos, Instagram reels. So this is uh, the back end. Now you can either start from a template or from a PowerPoint. And in the future, you can start from a prompt. Okay, so right now they have all of these templates you can choose from. Now I'm gonna open this. So basically you can change, it's similar to Canva where you add your text, your elements here, and then this is your AI avatar. So let me play it for you. Four SEO tips you need to know. The first one is to do keyword research. Second, have a fast loading website. Third, make sure your content is engaging. And last, 
run a backlinking campaign. Okay, so that is how the results look like. Now, if you want to see my full demo and review of Spirit Me, just click the link in my description and same with Mini Course Generator as well. So again, if you want full access to my free Google spreadsheet, click the link in my description. I also highlighted some additional tools that I think are really good as well that I think you should get, including Uptime Monster. Um, just for the sake of time, I didn't discuss this one, but Uptime Monster also is a really good one. Okay, so hopefully you enjoyed this video. Please give me a like and also subscribe to my channel. If you wanna check out other videos, feel free to click any of the ones on the screen right now. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.